you. And I now give the floor to the Asian Forum for Human Rights and Development for a joint statement. Mr. President, the joint program on human rights between the UN and the Philippine government to provide technical assistance to the Philippines remains insufficient to address systematic and widespread human rights violations and ensure accountability. We welcome the joint program's priorities to strengthen domestic accountability mechanisms and rights-based approach to counterterrorism. However, it falls far short of these aims. We regret that it fails to stem ongoing violations, including extrajudicial killings, combat impunity, rollback institutionalized repression, and restore independence and credibility of democratic institutions. In December 2021, the Supreme Court upheld the Anti-Terrorism Act despite multiple petitions questioning its constitutionality. The law has created a chilling environment where expression and dissent are seen as security threats. Human rights defenders, activists and community leaders have been threatened and tagged as terrorists merely for criticizing state policies. We regret the deferral of the ICC investigation on the Philippines. The decision of the court perpetuates impunity and will further embolden autocratic leaders and repressive governments by allowing them to escape accountability for their crimes. The Council must continue its scrutiny of the situation in the Philippines and in clear absence of domestic accountability, establish international accountability measures as recommended by the High Commission. Without genuine accountability, the joint program will only serve as a means for the government to evade justice under the cover of cooperation. Thank you. Thank you.